You're watching Greater Brockton, Mark Lindy, your host, and today I have a fan favorite. I have Lynn Smith, who does all sorts of great things for our community. Lynn, welcome. Good to Thank see you. Thank you. Good to see you, Thanks Mark, for being as here. well. So you wear different hats in the community. Um, the, one, the thing we're talking about today is an outdoor movie that the Keith Park Neighborhood Association, KPNA, and the Campello Business Association are co-sponsoring together. Tell us about it, the date, the place, the time, and what the movie is. Absolutely. So we're so thrilled because back in 2013, we came up with the idea of Friday night flicks. You know, everybody in Brockton says, oh, we don't have a movie theater. Mm -hmm. So we found a company that will come and bring a giant inflatable 22-foot screen, and we set it up in the park, and it has Dolby surround sound and the whole nine yards, and we say to the kids, you know, come, bring a chair, bring a blanket. Remember when you used to go to the drive-in and your oh, parents yeah. would put you in the pajamas? Absolutely. And then when, they, when you got home, they would carry you in? So we're not the only ones that have done an outdoor movie. DW Field Park Association did one. Cy Iota Omega did one. So it's caught on in Brockton. So the Keith Park event is in Georgie Keith Park in Campello. Main and Plain and Montello Street. If you use GPS, you can plug in, I think, 1209 Montello or 1200 Montello, and it will get you close by. So we set up the screen. We provide a little snack and some um, drinks for the kiddos. And as soon as the sun goes down, 745 sharp, just like Showcase Cinema, the movie comes on at 745. And we're really thrilled this year because of the support of the Campello Business Association, we can show Spider-Man into the Spider-Verse. You know, that movie grossed $190 million in the United States. It won Best Animated Film mm -hmm. at the Oscars and Best Animated Film at the um, Golden Globes. So it's really, it's PG rated, it's two hours, but even if you're adult, it's really very clever and a very good movie. Well, usually the trick if you're an adult is to have a, a grandson or borrow a kid or whatever. But uh, some, of the, some of the animated movies, in, in, a, in a way, I'm not going to say adult themes in, in, in any kind of respect like that, but they're sophisticated. They are. And they're fun to watch. I, you know, I love like the Toy Story movies exactly. because of the animation and things like that. Yep. And I love the voices behind the movies, like the people in animated stuff. You never know whose voice That's is going right. to pop up. That's right. You're trying to figure out. Well, the, the hero of this movie is a young man called Miles Morales, I think. And he fights crime in a number of different dimensions. So I won't give the whole movie away, but they're already talking about a sequel and they're already talking about spin-offs. Spin so it's Friday night, August 23rd, 7.45 sharp. And the nice thing is because it's a night when the Crescent Credit Union across the street is closed, they let us use their parking lot. Okay, that's even better. So you can park at the Crescent Credit Union, so thank you to Jonah and all the guys at Crescent Credit Union for letting us do that. Use the lights to cross the street, the parking lights right there, set up your blankets in your pot, get your bag of popcorn, get your soft drink, and then 7.45 on the, on the button, uh, the movie will start. It is two hours, so it is kind of a late night for some kiddos, but they're so excited to be outdoors and look up at the stars. It's the end of the summer. Mm -hmm. Now, what happens with inclement weather? So watch our Facebook page, the Keith Park Neighborhood Facebook page, because by noontime on the day of the event, we have to decide whether it's a go or not. Mm -hmm. So we will post on our Facebook page either thumbs up or thumbs down. And if we have to postpone it, we'll put the new date right on the Facebook um, page. And it's all free? It's free because we have such wonderful support from the Campello Business Association. And I haven't talked to the Rotary yet, but last year Rotary helped us out a little bit with the cost of the popcorn. So I bet I might be able to get that as well. You know... The Urban Land Institute back in 2013 came and said to the folks in Campello, you know, try to get a little community organizing going, and we did that. Try to do improvements to the park, and we did that. 
try to get the fountain going in the park, and we did that. And so this is one of those events. You know, we do the Easter egg hunt, we do the holiday history lantern walk, and we do this Friday night flick. So that's one of our marquee events for the kiddos during the and, year. And your group also made sure they had a wonderful CVS in that community when they re redeveloped it and the sign and everything that's over there. It, right. It's it's Kim Pillow's a treasure and it's coming back. They mm -hmm. just did, uh, the kids from Southeastern just uh, worked on the, the trash barrels right. and put the Campello Business Association logo. The Campello yep. businesses are strong. They're great folks over there. Yep. And uh, I think the future future is bright for everything that you do. Absolutely. We just filled all of our little planters with flowers and my uh, my uh, business owners each got, each got their ceremonial watering can to keep them um, going. So I think you're right. You know, progress sometimes is a little slow, but progress is being uh, made. So the only thing we do ask is that children be accompanied by a parent because it is kind of a late yeah. night. So we do ask that when you come on the 23rd of August, um, Bring a chair, bring a blanket, bring as many kids as you can wrangle and come and enjoy the movie and have a great time in Campello. And there are great local merchants you can support as well. There Absolutely. are a few restaurants there, the CVS, there's donuts. You're going to provide food and stuff, but there's other businesses if people want to That's right. You know, we had our Flag Day picnic last, uh, just recently. We had over 100 kids come and they did all the old-fashioned relay races and sack races and ring toss and all of that type of thing. We filled the park with kiddos. So we're really, really thankful to all our volunteers and all our supporters that really help the Keith Park Neighborhood Association do events like these. And I'm sure Spider-Man would be very happy as well. Absolutely. Well, look, thanks for doing all that you do with your group. Uh, the date is August 23rd, which is a Friday, Friday night. night. 745 sharp is right. when the movie starts, and uh, it's all free. Perfect. Thanks, Lynn. Thank Always you, a pleasure. Mark. Always a pleasure. You're watching Greater Brockton. Mark Linda, your host. Stay tuned for more events, places, people, and faces right here in the City of Champions.